Well, when you gonna catch a fish, Joe? Yeah, I hear you. But see, you ain't being real fair this morning. Well, I mean, shit, you catching all the front of the boat fishing ain't leaving no damn holes for the kid back here. Yeah, I'm watching your technique. I got you down. I'm good and track. Yeah, you got something. Yeah. You want me to get the net? No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and lift him over. He didn't come out the water, did he? Dude, I got an eyeball hook. Okay, I got him on camera. You got him hooked, so. Reach down there and lift him. Lift him. You think Bill Dan's scared of fish? You ain't seen nothing to you. see me be scared of fish. Watch him. Hi. Yeah. Hi, right, Carl. Come let get me, him out of my boat. Let me get a close up of this sucker. That'd be a pike. You get close up on them. Yeah, we got teeth. Yeah, buddy. Oh. Alright, well, I'm gonna let them back loose. Yep. You gonna give me big fish today? All right, so far, you wanna measure them? Uh, Alright, we'll put a measure on them, because this is probably the biggest pike we have caught. Yeah. Uh, you gonna be need a bigger measure. 18, 19, almost 20. Okay. Big pike of the day. Get back. Quick, quick. <laughs> <laughs> so there wasn't nothing stylish about that, was there? No, sir. But uh, with a pike, you can't be too careful, I say. Yeah. Unless you want to end up with another figure like that, <laughs> quick. Mm -hmm. I hear you. Well, shoot, I know you got to be feeling good. Yes, sir. Feeling good now. Yeah. Get a sip of coffee here. Get a sip of coffee. Oh, look at my door. Oh, I ain't even gonna look. Make sure. Whew. Get back. Well, All right. Know he hit hard, don't you? Yeah, I heard him. All right. Well, I'm ready to do another one. All right. He didn't die down. How you doing, Joe? I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. How are you, Carlo? Pretty good. I see you doing a little fly fishing. Yes, sir. You want to watch a little technique? Yeah, you Get know this. Get in the line, slap it back, and let it loose. All right, I'll, I'm going to watch your hand here a second. Yes, then I'll catch, see what see, see what the line is doing. You ought to be doing fly. so pretty. Alright, let me turn around here and see what's going to happen here. Alright. Oh, man. So sweet. No oh, man, that come by my ear. I felt that. But it was smooth, man. Smooth, though. There appears to be nobody back there that wants to fly. I'm going to give him a shot. There's a fish by that log. Yeah, I just missed one by that log right there. Fly, but, uh, yeah. But then with the boat twisting around on you, I know that's... Right <laughs> I fix it fall out the damn boat here. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. 
<laughs> Smooth shit, huh? Yeah, you can use your head sometimes to just make sure you got the enough resistance on the line. Uh huh. That. Well, tell us what kind of setup you got there, you know, for a beginner, you know? Well, for a beginner, we figure the best thing you ought to do if, you, if you're going out to buy you a fly fishing outfit, the first thing you want to buy is your line. Get some high quality, weight forward line. Not a number eight. This is number seven, but I know what I'm doing. You want number eight if you're beginning. Get mm -hmm. you a good rod. Good rod. You don't have to spend a lot of money, but get a good rod. All right, all right. You gonna have to speak up. My battery's getting low. <laughs> your battery's getting low. Real? Don't worry about the real. Buy the cheapest real you got. You know what your real is for? The store of the line. Store of the line. That's it. Okay, so you buy your line first, and it's weight forward. Weight forward, number eight. Number get eight. Your good rod. All right. What you call a good rod? How long is your rod? About eight foot, eight, eight and a half, something like that will be, be good for you. Uh-huh. You want something limber or stiff? Very or? limber. Very limber as you can get. Yeah. This is a graphite. Uh-huh. Fiberglass will do it, but uh, graphite does it better. Just like when you're buying your, uh, buying your other fishing pole, you got to get a good one. No sense getting that cheap. Don't be driving a $16,000 boat and have a $5 rod. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to put this away in just a second here because they don't seem to be popping on it. No matter how good you cast. All right, what, what is your choice for the leaders, you know? You, I see you got a clear a leader. 12-pound line leader. 12-pound line. 12-pound, 12-15-pound 12, line leader. And you got a popping bug on, I see, huh? Popping bug on the front here. Yeah. Just a little bit of leaves is all I got.